NUR Contency Batch 1994 through the scholarship they granted to me really helped me achieving my dream of becoming a certified public accountant. First, I applied for the scholarship through Ms. Irma Bandada, then Doc Clarita Lacson, our department head, that time informed me that I was qualified and was granted the scholarship for my review. The scholarship covered the whole tuition fee for my formal review at PRTC Bacolod. It was a huge help for me and for my parents since that time we were really struggling during my review. And with the Lord's grace, fortunately I passed the board on October 2015. And now I'm a practicing CPA and currently connected at Negros Occidental Electric Cooperative. This video was intentionally created for his students. Hello class, good morning. So I'm here again to discuss the uh, chapter 2 of our subject. Our topic is all about transaction processing. Our objectives for the chapter are as follows. Broad objectives of transaction cycles. Types of transaction process by each of the three transaction cycles. So later we will discuss about transaction cycles. Basic accounting records in the transaction processing. Traditional accounting records and their magnetic equivalence. Documentation techniques. Batch and real-time processing and the impact of these technologies on transaction processing. So first, what is a financial transaction? So in transaction processing, the financial transaction is being processed. That's why transaction processing. Okay. So first, what is a transaction or a financial transaction? Is an economic event that affects the assets and equities of the firm is reflected in its accounts and is measured in monetary terms. Okay. So economic event. May effects sa uh, asset or liabilities and or equity. Similar types of transactions are grouped together into three transaction cycles. The first is the expenditure cycle, conversion cycle, and the revenue cycle. Okay. So the relationship between the three cycles. Expenditure, conversion, and revenue. So, in an expenditure class, it involves the purchasing, disbursement, because expenditure mo, expenses, payroll, while sa conversion, production, planning, and control, cost accounting. Okay. Conversion because this is where the uh, finished products or the raw materials is converted into finished products. That's why conversion. Revenue cycle. Sales order, no? sales, revenue, and cash receipts. Okay. So from customer, we sell our finished goods, convert them into cash, no? flow into the revenue, cash is being paid for the expenses, no? payroll, it's assets, disbursements are being paid for labor, materials, physical plan, and these are used in the conversion or manufacturing process. Okay? Production, cost accounting, finished goods, then back to revenue for sales or distribution. Okay? Next, each cycle has two subsystems. In expenditure cycle, time lag between the two due to credit relations with suppliers. No? So, two subsystems, physical and financial. Physical acquisition of goods, financial, the cash disbursement. Okay? Because class, not all uh, payment to suppliers are in cash. So there is a time lag. So usually, uh, businesses pay on credit. Usually 30 days, 15 days. Okay? So there's a time lag. Utang, kumbaga utang. Okay? Conversion cycle. Production system in the cost accounting system. So production, planning, scheduling, and control of physical product through the manufacturing process. 
while cost accounting monitor the flow of cost in cost information related to production because class cada stage of production there is a uh, cost relating to it okay so attributed to it so gaw po dit sila dua next revenue cycle the same with expenditure physical and financial there's a time lag also because not all sales are on cash actually they are they are in credit man utang man kumbaga so ar sales diba so not all are converted into cash immediately okay next manual system on records source documents used to capture and formalize transaction data needed for transaction processing no examples of source document class invoice or uh, receiving report delivery receipt so and many more product documents the result of transaction processing turnaround documents a uh, product document of one system that becomes a source document of another system now simple example lang ang delivery receipt or OR ni supplier at abot na sa ito sa product system na nila then ang ina OR start naman na sa ito nga transaction processing timabayad naman ito sa ila so maging source document naman na on our part okay. so supplier ita source uh, product or source document turn around document manual system Accounting records, sorry. Journals, a record of chronological entry. No, journals, familiar na kami class kay. You have uh, been through this. Special journals and general journals. Special journals, special classes occur in high frequency. Example, sales journal and purchase journal. General journal, non recurring, infrequent, and dissimilar transactions ledger a book of financial accounts no? two types gl and sl gl shows activity for each account listed in the chart of accounts so ano blang chart of accounts the list of all accounts right so, while sl shows activity by detail for each account type usually my sl class like ar ap no? because this the return siya mo so and ang bulk of transactions, damo, bulky katama. Okay, flow of economic events into the GL. Customer order, sales order, then entry sa journal, then post sa AR, SL, then sales journal to GL. Tapat class, ma-reconcile ang GL kag SL sa AR. Okay. So, accounting records in a computer-based system. So, your class, the explanation on the side. So, let's go na lang sa flowchart. This order, SO, Kiki, at sa transaction file, update, okay. Then sa master file. Then, pagka-order, may AR ka, may sales mo. Then, ang inventory subsidiary because ang um, ibrigya mo i- Ibawas mo man sa inventory, kinamligyan na. Okay. Then, ang balances ng D-class, ASL to GL, makato sa balance sheet, AR. Okay. So, may audit train man siya class. So, from balance sheet, to GL, to SL, to journal, back to sales order. Or sales order to journal, to ARSL, to GL, then to balance sheet. Either way. Okay. Next, audit trail. So, here's the audit trail. So, source document to journal to GL to financial statements. So, class, ang dinig direction, this is called tracing. Tracing class in audit. Okay, while from financial statements or opposite sine, financial statement to GL to journal to source document is called vouching. Vouching. I-vouch mo ang amounts from the FS down to its source documents. Okay? Kata should be able to trace in both directions. Sampling and confirmation are two common techniques. 
So, for example, tracing, another trade. Verify accounts receivable. So, control account sa GL, SL, dapat reconciled. Then, from sales journal, sales order shipping notice, cash receipts journal, deposit slip, and or remittance advice. Remittance advice class, another term for OR, official receipt. Computer-based systems. So, in manual systems, different from computer-based systems, especially the audit trail. Audit trail is less observable in computer-based systems than traditional manual systems. Data entry in computer programs are the physical trail. The data are stored in magnetic fields. Okay, computer files. Master file generally contains account data. Example, GLN SN. Transaction file. Temporary file containing transaction since the last update. Temporary file. Transaction file. Okay. Reference file. Containing relatively constant information used in processing. Example, tax tables, customer addresses. So, the, the information regarding its customers. No? Address, telephone number, no? etc. Archive, archive file contains past transactions for reference purposes. Archive. Let's go to documentation techniques. Okay. Documentation in a computer-based environment is necessary for many reasons. Five common documentation techniques. So, five class. Entity relationship diagram, data flow diagrams, document flowcharts, system flowcharts, and program flowcharts. So, entity relationship diagram is a documentation technique to represent the relationship between entities in a system. The REA model version of ERD is what they use in AIS. So REA, resources, events, and agents. Resources, cash, raw materials, events, the list of raw materials into production, agents, the inventory clerk, vendor, or production worker. Cardinalities represent the numerical mapping between entities. Like for example, one to many, uh, one to one, one to many, many to many. Okay, for example, one to one, one salesperson per car type. Okay, one to many, one customer, many orders. Vendor, many to many, many vendors, many inventories. The capacity to learn is a gift. The ability to learn is a skill. The willingness to learn is a choice. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, have a great week, and have a great life. Bye!